Hi guys, it's Mina, and I'm going to teach you how to make decorative boas for your room. If you saw my room tour, you know the tour I had a you know I have whoops. Sorry, my dog was at my dog thingy looked weird. And I have green, lime green and light pink boas. Sorry, you can't really see it cuz it's kind of dark over here. Here because of my And I'm going to teach you guys how to make boas. The first thing you'll need is some fun fur yarn, some stitch markers, because fun fur is really hard to see, size 11 needy knitting needles, and this is a size 6.50 millimeter crochet hook. And to get started, we are going to take our yarn. And just so you guys know, I have stitch, I'm suggesting you guys use stitch markers, because fun fur yarn is really hard to see. You are going to to make a slip knot and then pull it tight again don't make it too tight or else you're gonna be it's gonna be really hard to knit so you have your first stitch and you're gonna take your stitch marker and put it in front of the first stitch and cast on the second stitch and you take another stitch marker, put it on, and you're just going to keep doing it basically until you've used up all your stitch markers. Markers. And this project you are going, and if you're wondering how many stitches to cast on, you're going to cast on 22 stitches. So I think I've made about like 20 something, 21 stitch markers for this. So I have about five, four. Six, seven, Nine, ten, eleven. I mean, eleven. Sorry, if my counting is annoying. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Eighteen. Oh, hold on. Sorry, I didn't make enough stitch markers. I thought I had enough, but I guess I don't. Twenty. Wait, wait, wait. How many do I have? One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, five, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Twenty, sorry. Twenty one. Twenty two. Okay, so I have twenty two stitches. Sorry about my weird stitch mark. Sorry about my stitch markers in the way. So now what we're gonna do is we are going to knit and then slip the stitch marker. And we're gonna knit the entire first row and slip each stitch marker. Okay, so I'm going to do one more row for you guys. So basically you just knit.
crop knit, slip the marker, knit, slip the marker, knit, I mean slip the marker, knit, Slip the knit, slip the marker, knit, okay, slip the marker, knit, slip marker, knit, slip the marker. Knit. Slip the marker. Knit. Slip the marker. Knit. Slip the marker. Knit. Knit. Slip marker, knit. Knit. Slip the marker, knit. Slip marker, knit. Slip marker, knit, slip marker, knit. So basically, you're just gonna keep knitting and slipping the markers too, girls, until basically you have finished, uh, used up both your skeins of um, yarn. And so thank you for watching. I'm sorry this video is long. I'm gonna stop it here right now. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. Goodbye.